Hello, Year 6. Um, now, we're slightly altering how we're going to do maths teaching via these videos from today onwards. So today what you're going to get is we're going to have our beginning element of our session. So for the first five minutes or so, we're going to look at a skill that we've previously looked at in our uh, learning within years one to five. And after that, you're going to be asked to click on the video um, which White Rose provide, which is exactly the same teaching slides as I was using. But luckily for you guys, you get somebody else talking. So this morning, um, or this afternoon, depending on when you're doing your maths, what I'd like you to have a look at is these maths questions which relate to our Roman numerals, because it's an area we found a little bit tricky. So if you see the first element of this sheet, um, you've got some Roman artefacts, and on these artefacts there are some numbers, um, and you need to translate these numbers into what we consider English, so our standard number representation. If you look at the first one, I can see two vertical lines, um, and those are worth two. So the first answer is two. Once you've completed those, the second element of this is going the opposite way around, where you've got your your standard uh, values written as we would appreciate them, and you need to write those as Roman numerals. Now, if you could pause the video, and whilst you pause it, have a go at completing those, that would be ideal, please. If you're not sure, before you pause it, have a look at the top and you can see that 1, 5, 10, 50, 100, 500 and 1,000 are replicated at, top, at the top of the page. So if you're not sure, that is there to help you. Here's our answers. Um, so we've seen uh, as we go through these, they get increasingly complex as we look through them. For me, I think some of the ones near the bottom of the screen are really very complicated. So if you've managed to achieve all of those, that's fantastic. Well done. If you found them tricky, don't worry. We'll practice these more as we go through the week. What I would like you to really note, though, is the idea that you never see the same value, uh, the same Roman symbol shown more than three times in a row. So, for example, when we've got um, uh, CXIV, so 114, we don't see the one four times. We see that it's one before the five. So one before the five. So it's one before the five is four. OK, so we don't see that value replicated four times. And the same, if you look down at 330, you can see that the CCC XXX, but uh, there is not any replication of the same digit or the same value four times in a row. Okay, that's something to remember with them. Next little challenge relating to these, this, this one will take two minutes. So if you look at these values, there's pairs, are, there's pair number two, well, I should say pair number one, sorry, pair number one, pair number two, pair number three, and pair number four. Looking at those, your job is to circle, write down which of those two values is the greater value. So which is the greater value, the CM or DCC? So if you think back to your learning from earlier, that first one, you know that C is worth 100, uh, D is worth 500, and M is worth 1,000. So if CM means it's 100 less than 1,000. And DCC means it's 200 more than 500. So based on that knowledge, which do you think is going to be the larger? Then work through the other ones similarly. So pause the video again. Try and work through those, please. OK, guys, hopefully now you've had a chance after pausing the video to think through. So and here we go. Here's your answers. So you can see that CM, which means 100, few, 100 less than 1,000. So 900 is greater than DCC, DCC being the value of 700. CX would be 110, which is less than CL, CL being 150. CCLX is 260 which is less than 100 fewer than 1,000, 100 less than 1,000, which is at 900. So 900 is greater than 240, 260, sorry. And then finally, we've got LV, which is 55, which is greater than LIV, which is 54. Well, you all got that way. Right. OK, guys, so the second element of the lesson today, then, is the video, which is the second link. And then you'll have your worksheet to complete. Please work through those. Do your very best, guys. I'm really looking forward to seeing you all again. We are hoping to set up some video calls soon. 
Um, but just generally keep going. It'd be great to see some of your work sent in as well. So if you've done some stuff at home, send it through to us. Okay. See you later, guys. Bye.